what fit for part of the time during World War II was the 5,307th Composite Unit Provisional, with the word provisional in parenthesis. That was the official designation. General Stilwell called it a long-range penetration group. It took a news correspondent to think up the name that stuck, Merrill's Marauders. The Marauders were formed as a result of the historic Roosevelt-Churchill-Quebec meeting. The stormy history of this unit includes a congressional hearing and leads finally to a distinguished unit citation, the equivalent of a personal commendation for every soldier in the outfit. The Marauders fought a tough war and it makes a terrific story. I suggest you grab their railhead first at this spot here. Shadows up. That'll knock out their transportation. So what the general is describing is a six months campaign over the, the worst terrain in the world. Not only unfair, it's impossible. Then it's your job to do the impossible. Yeah, this was the job they said we couldn't do. They called it impossible. Have you lost your watch? Getting my heavy stuff into position, sir. Well, what's holding you up? It had to be fought through jungles few men had walked over impassable mountains, steaming swamps, through country held by the victorious Imperial Army that had smashed Hong Kong and Singapore. They were a tough, battle-hardened enemy, but we were tougher. Almost 3,000 of us marched into that stinking, treacherous jungle, and barely 200 of us were left at the end. But we won. Yeah, this was a job they said couldn't be done. But the American fighting men who did it were called Merrill's Marauders. What's Merrill volunteering us for this time? Pick up the ammo, Bozai. Tell Merrill to pick it up himself! What'd you say? I said, tell Merrill to pick it up himself. If I've taken my last order from that butcher. I've decided to go on to Michina. My men can't make it. Yes, they can. General, it's not that they don't want to fight. They can't fight. If they've got an They just can't physically fight anymore. If they've got an ounce of strength left in them, they can fight. 